King Charles was pictured arriving at Clarence House today as he returned from Norfolk for prostate surgery. The monarch, 75, sat in the back of a liveried car as it drove down the mall past a smattering of onlookers. Charles returned earlier today by helicopter from Sandringham, where he has been resting for several days. He was keen to share his diagnosis to encourage other men who may be experiencing symptoms to get checked in line with health advice. It comes at a difficult time for the royal family with the Princess of Wales recovering in hospital from scheduled abdominal surgery and the Duchess of York revealing yesterday that she has skin cancer. The Princess of Wales is said to be doing well after going under the knife for her abdominal operation at the London Clinic near Regent's Park last week. She will remain in the exclusive clinic for up to 14 days, and is not expected to return to official duties until after Easter. Meanwhile, Sarah, 64, was diagnosed with malignant melanoma, an aggressive form of skin cancer, after several moles were removed during reconstructive surgery following her mastectomy in June. One was identified as cancerous and she is now undergoing further medical checks to make sure the cancer has been caught in the early stages. On Tuesday, the king's second son Prince Harry and his wife Meghan were pictured alongside Jamaican Prime Minister Andrew Holness, who wants to make Jamaica a republic, with a referendum set to be held later this year. Mr. Holness told the now Prince and Princess of Wales during their 2022 tour to the Caribbean that his country is moving on and intends to fulfill our true ambitions and destiny as an independent, developed, prosperous country. The Sussex's appearance came just as Harry's father, the King, prepared to undergo hospital treatment for an enlarged prostate, and Kate remains in hospital after abdominal surgery. With other observers still waiting for a statement from the Sussexes about Charles and Kate being in hospital, royal commentator Phil Dampier told Mail Online, It seems Harry and Meghan will turn up at the opening of an envelope these days.